from the lost generation revealing terrifying truths. In 2027, there was a huge technical revolution in the world, which began in 2025. To Gen Beta returning from the future with chilling warnings. And um, the sky was completely red. There was pollution everywhere. Encountering people from parallel universes has become increasingly common. We are orange a collective conscious and cyborg sent by a higher civilization to warn humans of the incoming apocalypse. Get ready for the shocking stories of those who have gotten lost somewhere between time and space. On April 23, 2006, a man in his early 20s was seen in Kyiv, Ukraine staring at a high-rise apartment building. This is the story of a man named Sergio, a mysterious time traveler from Ukraine. Back in 2006, he showed up in Kyiv claiming to be from 1958 with a funky ID card and all. Then things got weirder when his camera had pics from the 1950s, but he was in them wearing the same clothes as when he appeared. We found on the roll were photos of Kyiv, but clearly from a long time ago. All the cars, all the clothes, all the street signs, all were from the 50s. And there were photos of buildings that didn't exist anymore. Doctors thought it was aliens or time dilation. But you know what the crazier part was? Sergei vanished from a locked hospital room, leaving behind only old photos and baffled cops. But here's an even crazier part. When police checked the records, there was a missing person named Sergei who had disappeared in Kyiv in 1960 then reappeared years later, just like Sergei did in 2006. Coincidence? Or was he really a time traveler? What's your take on this mind-bending tale? They also were able to track down the woman in the photograph, his girlfriend. She told the police that Sergei had disappeared that day in 1958, but returned just a few days later, the exact amount of time that he had been in 2006. Then she claimed that he disappeared again in the 1970s, and this time he was never seen again. Future Girl. In 2022, a mysterious girl showed up online with a story that's just mind-boggling. She claimed she was born in 2006, but was actually from the future. Yep, you heard that right. I'm a doctor by profession. Most importantly, I was born in 2006. Of course, you may have questions because it's obvious that I'm not 16 years old. She said she worked for a company called LabGeo in 2028, which was doing some major medical breakthroughs. I received a job offer from an organization that was engaged in various experiments related to physical and psychological tests on humans. The company is called LabGeo, which was founded in 2024 in Canada. But when things went wrong, she had to escape using a prototype time machine. She even shared newspapers from 2027, featuring future events like Mars colonization and new tech. The clip went viral, sparking tons of controversy and skepticism. People were split. Some thought it was a stunt. So what do you think? Is it a glimpse into the future or just another wild story? Sometimes the future's just a click away. You can see this newspaper was published on February 26, 2027. Victor Goddard. Sometimes fate takes you for a ride you weren't expecting. In 1935, Victor Goddard was flying his plane from Edinburgh to Andover when he decided to check out an old abandoned airstrip from World War I. While he was flying over, a wild storm hit and he lost control. But once he regained it, things got weird. Below him, that once abandoned airstrip was now fully operational with new planes parked around it, ones he didn't recognize. He even glimpsed some future events before a vortex yanked him back to the present. Many chalked it up to a hallucination. But here's the thing. In 1939, the airstrip was renovated with the exact planes he had seen back in 1935. Time traveler? Maybe. But one thing's for sure. Sometimes the future flies in sooner than you think. Time Tale from 8973 Back in 2018, a guy named William Tylor claimed he time-traveled to some wild years like 3000 and 8973. He even took a lie detector test during an interview to prove it. Lie detectors aren't a 100% guaranteed way of telling if somebody's telling the truth. Are you an actual time-traveler who has visited the future? Yes, I am. 
Williams said that in 8973, he met some super evolved beings with mind reading abilities and super advanced tech. I remember they had abnormally large heads and large eyes as well. And did you talk with them? I did, yes. I, I spoke to them for quite some time and they told me that they lived forever and uh, they also didn't seem too surprised that I was there which led me to believe that time travel was quite a commonplace thing at that period of time in the future. But in the year 3000, things were totally different. It was a dystopian mess with pollution everywhere and the world in ruins. The trip to the year 3000 was a trip to a place where I, I don't think I'd want to be for too long and the sky was completely red. There was pollution everywhere. People online are split about his story. Some think it was all just a setup, while others believe he was telling the truth. And get this, he also predicted that by 2028, time travel tech might be available to everyone and will have super smart AI. Well, that's not too far off. Let's see what the future brings. There are plans on releasing time travel as a technology to the public in the year 2028. I think it would be beneficial for humanity to, uh, to know and understand that fact. Hipster mystery. This, this, is this an original? Oh! Oh, it's short. Oh, it's my original. God, you guys. Oh, my goodness. Ever heard of the time traveling hipster? This curious photo, unearthed from a 1940s Canadian museum, showed a man who looks like he's straight out of today's hipster scene. The pic captured the reopening of the Southport Bridge in British Columbia. Reopening of Southport yeah, Bridge means... after it being washed out in... But this guy's outfit stood out. While some claim his casual look and modern sunglasses were proof of time travel, others argued that his style fits well with 1930s hockey jerseys and knitted sweaters. Just more laid back compared to the crowd. So was this a slip through the time stream or just a casual dresser from the past? I guess we'll never know. Mirror glitch. And his face is moving. Look at that, his face just moved, but the guy in the, the mirror is seeing the same. In this bizarre footage, a man at a stoplight noticed something odd in his rear view mirror. The reflection of the man in the car ahead was eerily still. His face just moved, but the guy in the, the mirror is seeing the same while his face was moving normally. He even zoomed in to capture the strange anomaly. When the video hit the internet, it caused a stir. Some people thought it was just clever editing, while others speculated that it was evidence we are living in a simulation. Whatever the case, it was a reminder that sometimes reality might be stranger than fiction. His face just moved, but the guy in the, the mirror is seen the same. Yo! Crypto Future. After hearing my story today, you may think I'm crazy, but everything I say is true. My name is Carlos. I was born and raised in Alicante. Get ready to question everything you thought you knew. Carlos from Alicante, Spain claimed he was not just an ordinary guy, but a time traveler from 2040. Not from current times. I am from the year 2040. I know it sounds like some sort of science fiction story, but it's absolutely true. He revealed a future where cryptocurrency rules and a new payment system called Coin Salary dominates. I was saying the world will soon change drastically and it will start in 2020 when the cryptocurrency immediately became dominant of the dollar and the rest of the currencies we all know. According to Carlos, 2028 will bring a seismic shift, and by 2029, QR codes will replace traditional IDs. Everyone has a QR code on their hands, which contains all the information about that person. He sold his future crypto for cash, then traveled back to 2016, living lavishly ever since. Was this story a wild fantasy or a peek into our future? You decide. The maximum I could have was a small apartment in a bad neighborhood. I decided to sell everything I had and I bought the seemingly useless old $100 bills that gave the rest of the crypto coins to a time machine lab employee 
who secretly sent me back to 2016. Mysterious iPad. Sometimes we stumble upon videos that just leave us scratching our heads. Take this one from 1999, for example. It shows a political rally with a crowd of onlookers, but one person in that video stood out. Amidst the crowd, someone was holding what looked like an iPad. Weird, right? Considering iPads didn't exist until Apple released them in 2010? It's a real head-scratcher. This oddity got people talking. Could time travel be real? Or is it some kind of simulation glitch where things just don't add up? Either way, it makes you wonder about the strange and mysterious possibilities out there. Sometimes, the past holds secrets that just don't fit. Cyborg Warning in 2020, a guy named Orin surfaced online, claiming he was a cyborg from 2050. Now, at first, no one took him seriously, but he agreed to an interview where he shared some wild details. We are Orin, a collective conscious and cyborg sent by a higher civilization to warn humans of the incoming apocalypse. Orin said future tech had turned him into a cyborg with a chip for communication. He claimed he had time traveled to 2050 and witnessed an AI-driven apocalypse Apocalypse. According to him, he was sent back by higher powers with a warning. Humans are writing their own destruction with things such as disease, famine, environmental disaster, and technological singularity. We are here to warn humans and to prevent the fusion in the future that we have seen. He urged everyone to unite and fight against a threat he called the corporation. Was he telling the truth or just spinning a story? Well, I guess we'll have to wait until 2050 to find out. I suppose sometimes the future is just a story waiting to be told. Corporation aims and works solely for profit. We are here for the greater good of society. It is very much like the Matrix movie. This is all a simulation. Boxing fan. Who doesn't love watching Tyson's powerful punches? Well, even a supposed time traveler seemed to be a fan. During a Mike Tyson fight in 1995, someone in the crowd was spotted holding what looked like a smartphone. Now, we know smartphones weren't around back then, so how could this guy have one? The internet went wild with theories about Tyson being a time traveler who'd come back to his own fight. Skeptics, however, weren't convinced. After some digging, experts discovered it was actually an early camcorder and not a smartphone. They have solved the mystery. We did some digging and found out the device in the video is not a smartphone at all. It's an early version of a camcorder called the DiCam Logitech. Vanishing Act. At a Danish airport, a regular TV interview turned into something super bizarre. While the camera focused on a man being interviewed, viewers caught something strange happening in the background. A blonde woman just vanished into thin air as someone walked past her. Some skeptics waved it off as a camera glitch, claiming she just slipped into a blind spot. But others were haunted by the idea that it could have been something supernatural, like she slipped into another dimension. It became the talk of the town, with everyone debating what they saw. Time Machine In 2009, a video popped up online that left everyone scratching their heads. It showed what looked like an actual time machine, or maybe a dimensional portal of some sort. The footage captured a strange, round machine covered in lights, giving off a serious sci-fi vibe. As the camera person moved closer, the machine started going haywire, and suddenly, a portal-like thing appeared. But then, the footage went all glitchy, as the high frequency messed it up and we never got to see what happened next. Some people believe the camera person got sucked into another dimension, while skeptics think it was just a clever hoax. Real or not, it's still one of those mysteries that makes you wonder what's really out there. Future Confession Secret is that I came from 2030. A man claimed he was from the year 2030, and his story was straight up crazy. In 2027, there was a huge technical revolution in the world, which began in 2025. According to him, in the future, everyone will get a chip implanted that makes them super smart and super connected. But here's the kicker. 
He said he actually time traveled back to 2018 and even had this golden chip with him, supposedly the same one that'll be implanted in humans. By the way, I will show it to you now. This little device, which at first sight is nothing, changed the whole world in just a few years. By the way, it is covered with real gold from the inside. Naturally, the internet exploded with different reactions. Some people thought he was bluffing, saying it was all staged, while others believed he might actually be from the future pointing out Elon Musk's Neuralink initiatives. Whether it's all a stunt or not, one thing's for sure. If he's right, the future's going to be unthinkable. Greatly improved the ability to think, to remember. It can be said that the chip is a kind of brain upgrade. Mystery Man. Back in the early 2000s, there was this mysterious guy called John Teter who showed up online saying he was a time traveler from 2036. And there's this one video where he appears to be walking into some kind of portal. According to him, he was part of a military unit called the Time Travel Division and detailed a C-204 time displacement unit that could mess with time. Titor made some wild predictions, like the end of the space shuttle program and the spread of mad cow disease. While some of his claims were true, many weren't. His sudden disappearance in 2001 left people puzzled. Was he a hoax? or a secret agent sent to tweak history. The truth still remains hidden. Teleporting dog? A few young guys were racing their cars down the highway. Everything was cool until out of nowhere, a dog just appeared and crossed the road. The moment was so bizarre that people were losing their minds, saying the dog must have teleported from another dimension because there was no other way to explain it. Of course, skeptics suggested it was just a camera glitch or some clever editing. But after some deep analysis, experts claimed the footage was legit. So what's the deal? Could this really be a time traveling dog? Or is there another explanation we're missing? It's one of those mysteries that leaves you questioning everything. Guardian Flash? In 2012, something super weird happened at a crossing. A truck was speeding toward a man who had no clue he was in danger. Just when they were about to collide, something or someone zipped in and whisked the man to safety. It all happened in the blink of an eye, but some sharp-eyed viewers noticed a flash in its hand before it calmly walked away like nothing had happened. Both the man and the driver were left totally stunned, and even authorities were baffled. Was this some real-life flash saving the day? Or maybe even a guardian ghost? I guess it's one of those things we might never figure out. But hey, Sometimes life's mysteries are better left unsolved. Chase. A boy was just strolling down the street. Everything was normal, but then, bam, he suddenly looked back like he had seen something spooky. Next thing you know, a flashlight flashed on the screen and that kid vanished into thin air. The internet exploded with theories. Some netizens were saying it was just a slick edit or a made up video, while others thought the boy might be a time traveler who just jumped dimensions to escape something or someone. Was he fleeing from the future or just caught in a weird trick of the camera? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Time Twisted Phone. Let's rewind to 1928, during the premiere of Charlie Chaplin's The Circus. In a bizarre twist, a man appeared with what looked like a modern cell phone. Except cell phones weren't even a thing back then. How could this be? For decades, netizens have cooked up wild theories. Some suggested it was a universe glitch, while others believed it hinted at time travel. Despite various explanations, the mystery persists. Was it a sneak peek into the future or just an optical illusion? People are still talking about it to this day and everyone has their own theories. Looks like it's a mystery that might never be solved. Time Encounter. Yeah, it's something that happened under the disc and I was just coming longer and longer in there. It was dark and I could put myself up on this. Like in the 70s or maybe in the 70s or something like that. 
thinking about meeting your future self is pretty wild, right? Well, believe it or not, it actually happened to someone in 2006. This is the story of a Swedish guy named Hawen Nordquist. One day, he came home and found his kitchen was totally flooded. While he was trying to fix the problem, he reached under the sink and suddenly found himself in another time and place. And there, he met his future self. The story might sound easy to dismiss, except for the fact he had a video on his phone that showed his older self, complete with the same tattoo on his arm. It seems like a solid case of time travel, though some people still think the video could have been edited. I don't believe it. There's a chance that people think about it, so I had it with me in my mobile phone, so I could film it. We stood there and chaffed a little bit. It was a really good chance, how good it was. Vanished Man Back in the 1950s, something really strange went down at Tokyo's Hana Airport. A well-dressed man showed up with a passport from a place called Torrid a country no one had ever heard of before. He had all the right documents and everything seemed legit, but no one could figure out where this mysterious Torred was. So the authorities took him in for questioning and placed him in a hotel room. But when they went to check on him the next day, he had vanished without a trace. No one ever figured out what happened to him, but some believe he might have been a time traveler or even an interdimensional traveler. Versailles Mystery Sometimes, the past doesn't stay in the past. In 1901, two English women named Moberly and Jourdain had a seriously strange experience while wandering around the gardens of Versailles. They were looking for the Petit Trianon, connected to Marie Antoinette, when suddenly they found themselves back in the late 18th century. Sounds wild, right? Well, they even saw people in old-fashioned outfits and buildings that didn't exist anymore. Oh, and of course, they swore they spotted Marie Antoinette herself. When they came back to the present, experts chalked it up to hallucinations or maybe just being overly tired. But Moberly and Jourdain were convinced it was real. Was it time travel? Or maybe something paranormal? Nobody really knows. But it's a mystery that'll leave you guessing. Future Buzz in 2018, a guy stirred up the internet by claiming he traveled to the year 6000. He said he was on a top secret military mission that sent him far into the future. According to him, technology in 6000 was beyond our wildest dreams. He even showed a photo of a futuristic city he snapped while he was there. Now you may notice that the actual picture itself is a little distorted. Uh, that is because in the time travel process, pictures tend to get distorted. He mentioned that time travel was pretty common back then and predicted that we'd have this tech by the end of the decade. So were his claims just hype or will we see these advancements soon? We didn't see them in 2020, that's for sure. So I guess we'll find out as the years roll on. Sometimes the future's just a prediction away. Now you may notice that the actual picture itself is a little distorted. Uh, that is because in the time travel process, pictures tend to get distorted. Time Traveler? In 1950, something strange occurred when a man named Rudolph, wearing old-fashioned clothes, showed up in Times Square and had an accident. When the cops examined him, they found unusual items. A token for a five-cent beer from a bar no one knew about, a bill for horse care, and old banknotes worth $70, all perfectly preserved. The police couldn't figure out who he was, but they found a man whose father had vanished in 1876, stirring up theories about Rudolph's true identity. Now, some think it's just a tall tale, while others see it as a real mystery. But to make things even stranger, a newspaper article appeared before the incident, adding another layer to the mystery of Rudolph Fence. Curious, isn't it? Vanished Genius Ever heard of Ettore Majorana, the physicist who vanished without a trace? Born in 1906, Majorana was known for his groundbreaking work on neutrinos and Majorana fermions. In 1938, he disappeared, leaving behind a cryptic note hinting at his possible departure or disappearance. Theories about his fate are split. 
Some believed he was disillusioned with how his research was being used after World War II and might have escaped through time travel or alternate dimensions. Others think he met a tragic end. The truth remains elusive, sparking endless speculation. Sometimes the most brilliant minds leave behind the greatest of mysteries. Time-worn glare. They say history has a way of repeating itself. In 2019, teenage climate activist Greta Thunberg went viral after giving a memorable glare at President Trump during a UN speech. But things took a wild turn when people noticed her uncanny resemblance to a girl working in a mine from 1898. As the video spread, theories exploded. Some suggested Greta herself might be a time traveler sent to save us, while others thought it was just a strange coincidence. So what's the real story? Are we looking at a case of time travel or just an odd twist of fate? Sometimes we're left with more questions than answers. Time to go back. A 27-year-old German man was seen at the airport, looking totally normal with his bags. But just 10 minutes later, he was spotted running frantically without his bags, as if he was fleeing from something or someone. He sprinted out of sight, and that was the last anyone saw of him. So where did he go? Some thought he might have been a time traveler who rushed back to his own timeline after witnessing something crazy in the future. But what's your take on this? Was he escaping from something in the future, or is there another more plausible explanation? Drop your theories in the comments. Glitch in the Matrix They say reality sometimes plays tricks on us. At a Russian intersection, cars were waiting for the green light when something bizarre happened. As the light changed and traffic began moving, two cars collided, but one of them seemed to appear out of nowhere as if it materialized from thin air. The footage of this strange incident went viral instantly. With such a weird occurrence, theories started flying. Some think it's a glitch in the matrix. Others suspected secret government portals, but many believed it could be time travel. What do you think happened here? Was it a real time traveler or something else entirely? Share your thoughts in the comments. Russian scientist. In Russia, something truly strange unfolded on a highway. A lorry swerved suddenly to avoid hitting a man who seemed to appear out of nowhere. The guy was dressed in a lab coat with black boots, and he looked utterly disoriented as if he had no idea where he was. The truck driver, who narrowly missed him, stopped to check it out. The footage quickly went viral, sparking all kinds of theories. Some people think it's proof that Russia is testing futuristic tech or even experimenting with teleportation. It was like something straight out of a sci-fi movie. So what's the deal here? Well, no one knows for sure. Sometimes reality feels just as wild as fiction. Missouri Guy. In 1995, Mike Markham from Missouri started building a time machine in his house. He used an electric Jacob's Ladder and a modified CD laser to create a weird heat vortex. Amazingly, it worked, making objects disappear and reappear. So he decided to build a bigger machine to transport humans through time. By 1997, he had his larger machine, but needing heavy electricity, he tapped into the local grid station. It was a disaster. When the police checked his house, Markham was gone. Strangely, there was a connection to a body found on a Florida beach in the 1930s. Did Markham travel back and meet his end? It's a wild theory, but the truth still remains a mystery. I suppose sometimes the quest for discovery leads people to the most unexpected places. Time travel snack? On a night in January 2016, something bizarre happened in an unknown location. A homeless person was sleeping in front of a store when a couple walked by, found it closed, and left. Shortly after, a man in a black hoodie approached the store, walked straight into the closed door, and vanished inside. As he entered, the camera and lights went haywire. Minutes later, he emerged with a sandwich. The footage sparked wild theories, with one popular idea being that the hoodie-clad man was a hungry time traveler. The homeless person reported feeling something odd, but didn't see anyone enter or leave. It's like a scene straight out of a sci-fi movie. Strange sight. Now this was something you definitely don't see every day. 
In France, locals were left scratching their heads over a bizarre scene. In the middle of a parking lot, there sat a car. Nothing unusual, except for the fact that a fully grown tree was sticking right out of it. People were standing around totally stunned, trying to figure out how it was even possible. Some even checked underneath the car. And guess what? It was 100% real. But how on earth could this happen? Some thought it was a time-traveling car with a parking problem, while others suggested it was a glitch in the Matrix. Who knows what the truth is? But for sure, it was a heck of a mystery. <laughs> Teleportation Mystery When crossing the road, dodging high-speed traffic is usually the goal, right? Well, this guy seemed to skip that part entirely. In a CCTV clip, a person suddenly appeared on the other side of the road out of nowhere. Like, one second he wasn't there, and the next he was. The footage was so clear that it left people baffled, sparking wild theories about a glitch in the Matrix or something equally bizarre. Maybe it was just some clever video editing. Or perhaps, if we're thinking outside the box, a man teleporting from another dimension. <laughs> Jokes aside, no one's been able to explain it. So the mystery remains unsolved. Just another reminder that the universe still has its secrets. Spooky Teleportation There was this freaky video that blew up online. And I mean seriously, this one was wild. It starts with a woman walking outside totally by herself. All of a sudden, she stops and reaches out like she's grabbing something, but there was nothing there. Then, out of nowhere, a little girl just appears right next to her. The weirdest part? The woman wasn't even phased. It's like she'd done it a million times before. People were convinced the woman summoned the girl. And the fact that she seemed so chill about it made it all the spookier. So what's the real deal here? Was the girl a teleporter? Or did the woman somehow make this happen? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Paddled Mystery Sometimes what you see isn't always what's real. In this puzzling video, while the camera holder was chatting with musicians, a man on a bicycle seemingly materialized in the background. What made this even creepier was that nobody around seemed to notice, like he appeared out of thin air. This footage quickly went viral and sparked debates across the internet. Experts suggested it might have been a perspective trick or editing manipulation. Logical explanations aside, some people still weren't buying it. They were convinced that the cyclist had to have appeared out of nowhere, making this a mystery that stirred endless controversy. Sometimes, life's strangest moments don't come with explanations. Time Mystery Recently, archaeologists uncovered something totally bizarre from a sealed Ming Dynasty tomb that left scientists scratching their heads. Inside, they found a modern-looking Swiss ring watch in a 400-year-old tomb. Yeah, you heard that right. Swiss! Even though Switzerland didn't exist until much later on, people went with wild theories, from time travelers to hoaxes. Some skeptics claimed it might have been left behind by tomb raiders, while others can't shake the idea that it could be a time traveler's watch. Whatever the case, no one can explain how this watch ended up there. Makes you wonder, do we really know as much as we think about time as we do? Well, time certainly has a funny way of messing with us. Scooter Slip A lady was unloading her luggage from a car trunk, and everything looked to be normal. But then, as she bent down, a guy on a scooter zoomed by. And whoosh! He vanished into thin air with a weird white streak! The video went viral and sparked all kinds of theories. Some people said it was a glitch in the Matrix, or maybe a time traveler on the run. Skeptics, however, argued it could just be a camera glitch or an editing trick. Well, whatever it was, it left everyone else scratching their heads. So what's your take? Matrix mishap or time traveling stunt? Go ahead, drop those comments below. Advanced Ladies If you're skeptical about time travel, this one here might make you rethink it. In an old 1938 video, everything seemed normal until two ladies caught attention. One of them appeared to be talking on a mobile phone. 
something that did not exist back then. So naturally, this odd sight raised a couple eyebrows. Was it just a piece of cloth resembling a phone? Or were these ladies actually time travelers? The theories are wild, but there's no solid proof to back up the claims. It's a head scratcher that keeps us wondering, was it a glitch or a glimpse into the future? Open discussion. Recently, a mysterious video appeared online from a man named Viktor Nikolaev, claiming to be from the year 2133. He's got some wild news. Time travel was invented by 2050, and he's here to fix the past. In the year 2050, scientists started developing the first methods of what we consider time travel. It started opening the door to the possibility that people could go back into the past. Sounds weird, right? Well, according to Victor, the future isn't all flying cars and moon colonies. Instead, we're facing huge problems like plastic storms and a world where people are controlled before they even act. He even mentions Donald Trump's bizarre attempt to become Canada's prime minister. In 2020, the United States president, Donald Trump, will lose the election and this will cause him to try and become the prime minister of Canada. This will also fail and have a very bad effect on the world years later on. Was this guy for real? Or was it all a high-tech hoax? What's your take? Many people think the future will have flying cars and we will live on the moon. But this is not true. Yes, things will be different. Better, but there are many problems. They arrest you before you do a crime. Governments control the people. People are very unhappy. They are like machines. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.